nice mission from North America. Kind of curious how the soldiers are... Whoa, wrong base. How the soldiers are progressing over there. I don't really know... If anybody did anything too extraordinary during that mission, it looks like maybe... Yeah, Gunter Unger did a, uh, did a pretty decent job, I suppose. Got a little bit of accuracy, but mostly in these, I suppose, secondary stats that always go up. Pretty good improvement there, and then a bunch of rookies who haven't really done anything yet. I think they got enough soldiers for a little while. We will buy a few more, though, just in case. Right, can't wait for that living quarters to finish up in a week. Research is still going on the heavy plasma clip. It is currently unknown, so they don't know what they're doing yet. That is fine, and they're working on workshops. You guys? Yeah, they got the living quarters and all that. These will probably just be manufacturing places. I don't really need money, but you never know. Maybe, uh... Maybe something horrible will happen. Like a very large in our back door. What are you doing? It's heading for us, whatever it is. Could be a terror ship? Not really sure. Oh god. Nope. 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 I remember. That's not one you play with. That one will annihilate us. Maybe it'll land. Or just go away. Oh boy. I don't remember if that's the battleship. I think that's the battleship, meaning it's looking for us. Oop, and I think it's finally going. Right down there in South America somewhere. Boy, that's scary. Um, if they're sending battleships to look for us, we might need to consider getting... I want to consider getting that mine shield and grab shield. Gotta do that hyperwave decoder still? Really? My god, I'm so far behind. Alright, let's queue this up. Because I gotta get this hyperwave decoder done, and I could have sworn I already did this, but... Guess not. The mine shield will reduce the chances of them finding our base, but it might be a bit late for that. Uh, plasma defenses are okay, but when I do the blaster launcher and blaster bombs, I think that'll unlock a different type of base defense, which is very good. So, we'll try to hold off on that. Worst case, Alps gets attacked and North America becomes the new primary base. As scary as that is, but... Hey, these things happen. Oh god, what are you... doing? They're so upset at us. Yeah, they're definitely looking for us. That's going to be another battleship, isn't it? Nope. Just, no, 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 stop. Wrong button. Yeah, it's another battleship. We'll, um, we'll disengage from that. And just pray. They're pretty much going to keep doing this until they find us, and then we, um... Oh, my god. Okay. Um... Oh, it's so bad. Okay. I'm trying to figure out what we can do here. Because normally, when something like this happens, you have to transfer all of your extra weapons and equipment over to a different base because there's an 80 item limit. And when you get attacked, it just kind of throws all the soldiers you have into battle with whatever gear it kind of wants to do. So for me, it'd probably be a ton of electro flares. Why do I have 86 electro flares? I don't know. I probably bought all of them once upon a time. Just as a buy a bunch type deal. Let's get rid of... Let's get rid of smoke grenades, proximity grenades. High explosives are nice. I will keep some smoke grenades. Who am I kidding? They're handy. Don't need the stun rods. Don't need electro flares. Because uh, we got stun launchers for stun rods. So we'll just substitute. Ton of Illyrium. A mind probe? I don't really need that, but... 
I think mind probes are just for scouting like what the alien is. It allows you to see their stats and their ranks so you know if it's a commander or not. So with that, it's cool, but it does take time to research, and that's not exactly something I have much of. <sighs> we got a ton of heavy plasma and a lot of heavy plasma clubs, so if we get attacked, it'll probably give us that stuff, but we can't use them because they're still working on figuring out what the clip is. So hopefully we can hold off for a little longer. Oh, man. Please just stay away for a little longer, man. Where did you come from? All right. Whatever. We detected him really far out. Come on, heavy plasma clip. Oh, medium grounded southeast. Uh... Fuck, it's like nighttime though. It's the issue. We'll have to send an Interceptor 3 out there. It's a medium, so it's probably like a harvesting mission type thing. Not too concerned about it. Yay, the two dudes from North America. Kevin Kemp and Emil Brevenu. Sweet. Welcome aboard, guys. Okay, five seconds. Maybe we can get a Sky Ranger from the Alps over there. Maybe I think we can send the Sky Ranger. Oh god, I sent the wrong one. Uh alright, well, we'll see. It looks like we got enough guys on there to handle it. We'll see if we can get there at daytime and before it takes off again. Yeah. They usually take off during the morning. I meant to send and descend an interceptor. It's alright, even if we do shoot it down, it'd be over water, so it's a lost mission. Well, humph. This is not going to be a good month for us. Another medium. What in the hell? And now it's refueling, of course. Still refueling. Suppose we could maybe send the North America Sky Ranger at it? I don't know if it'd get there in time. No, it's not going to get there in time. Maybe you could do some scouting while you're down there at least. Plasma rifle. I guess. Uh, do you guys have clips? Some. Yeah, alright. Hmm. Not sure why I did that. I got heavy plasma coming soon, and then they can just have the plasma rifles that I'm going to be getting rid of. Because I'm going to have a lot of plasma rifles. I got plenty of heavy plasma for everybody. Got a lot of plasma rifles that could definitely do the job. Not sure why I did that, but hey, whatever. Who cares? It's already done. Medkit slots. 83? Sure, why not? Um, could they start their own Avenger? I don't think so. I don't think they have anything for it. Oh, right, I sent their interceptor out. Never mind. Never mind. And he lost him. Put a last known position way down there somewhere. Don't know if we'll be able to catch up to him again. He's going pretty quick. Yeah, this is just a poop month. That's all there is to it. Not going well. A lot of craft were detecting it, but it's just far out that we can't really do much about it. Very small, very high north. That's something that we could probably do. I keep selecting you. You don't have anything, though. Can you catch up to him? Yeah, yeah you can. Try to do it over land. I need to do a mission. 
Although you'll probably just destroy him. One more. There we go. Yeah, you're going to destroy him. It's a very small little thing. Sorry, right, still get some points for destroying them. North America's living quarters is complete, meaning they can have more dudes. Um, ultimately, I think I did it for research purposes. No, they don't have a lab. Um, I guess I just did it for... More space for dudes. Man, I gotta write this stuff down. I keep forgetting why I did this stuff. I guess just to have more dudes there. Hmm. It's another one of them harvesters, I think. Let's get the Sky Ranger from Alps over there. Get it ready, because if it does land for whatever mission it's on, my god. Way down there, huh? Just return to base. You're not going to be able to do anything. It'd be nighttime by the time you get there. No, low on fuel. Hell, okay. It's gonna be nighttime. Their timing is really good. No, cancel. That guy. Who's he gonna take off and he's gonna outrun you because you're just an interceptor? Oh boy. Go for that guy. He's a bit more important. Okay, never mind. Don't go for that guy. Disengage. Oh, poop. It landed. Why did it land? It's a battleship, isn't it? I didn't know battleships landed. I didn't think that was a thing they did. God, and everybody's refueling now. I don't know if North America could get over here fast enough. What one are you? You're the small. I can do that one. You're the very large and you're that medium. Okay. Get over water. A little more. There we go. Please, give us something to do. Right, and you've landed over there, that medium. Small, very high east. They're doing something over here. That very large just took off. Right. Two missions to do. Um, that one's going to be taken off any second now. If we have the Avenger, it's fast enough. You can usually get over there quickly. Um, I'm going to make sure that this place is okay for battle. Because I'll send them on one mission and send the other guys on the other. Many medkits as you can have. Hang on to the stun stuff. Um, yeah, why not? Because I do need to worry about keeping guys alive, and I've got enough alloys and uh, delirium now that I can just make more. And Alps, how are you guys doing? I think you guys are actually less equipped than the other base. Dwight Hamburger, welcome back. And Danielle. 
Because these guys, they don't have much armor. In fact, most of these dudes are naked. We gotta make more power suits at the other base, I think, rather than medkits. I didn't realize we were quite this low on stuff. Um, I think that'll all be fine, though. Does North America need to make more power suits? Flying suits are a little better protection-wise, but they cost three times as much. And that's an issue for me. Valyrium. Okay. I think we got a bunch of Valyrium we can send over there. I forgot how many. Oh, well, just like 80. That'll probably be fine. There you go. Enjoy. And mental note, this is now, well, not yet, but it is going to be making armor. Let's see if I remember. I highly doubt it, though. All right, you. North America head for that guy. That's the other small. We will get... We'll get the other place to head out in the morning. I suppose I could have gone for that medium. I really think it's going to be taken off, though. Any second now. Tracking lost. It was right there. How? Alright, just return to base. We got the mission going on. There it is. Found it. Thought it might have been a supply ship. Ah, god, this radar sucks. Another reason to get the hyperwave decoder. 100% chance of detection when anything crosses its path. Very nice. So we would have been able to spot that guy and keep him spotted. And there we are. That should be daytime enough. Kind of sort of dawn, finally getting a chance to do a mission. And a lot of you guys are unarmored. In fact, most of you are unarmored. But that's kind of okay. Michael Bailey steps off, turns right, and sees an ethereal. Ooh. So fine. It's only a small. And Michael Bailey one-shots everything he touches. It's awesome like that. But, because it's Ethereals, that means mind control. Meaning all you can do is pull out the medkit and do a little bit of Berserk healing. Oh man. I think we'll be okay. Ooh, that grass. Forget just how many time units, or I always forget just how many time units it takes to move through that grass. I always forget about until I am like stranded in the middle of a giant field of flowers. Ooh. Some down there. That's probably about where their ship is. Let's see if Oscar Stevens can round the corner and no, doesn't see anything. Yeah, that's definitely their ship. My god, Michael Bailey, dude, you are wicked overpowered. Seriously, you have to be, like, mentally squishy or something. I mean, there's got to be some downside to you. Ooh, Neil Watson sees one, too. You are not as accurate as Michael Bailey. But, still pretty good at aiming for the vitals. Making these ethereals look easy. Trust me, though, they are not to be underestimated. They are very, very dangerous. Especially their terror unit. Oh, the sectopod. Oh. They are not cool. Well, no, they're really cool, but they're not on my team, so they're not cool. They're lame. They're dumb. They're stupid. And... I think... If there were any buildings, it'd probably have one up here. 
Maybe? I don't know. I think I heard a sub door, though. Definitely saw one there. There we go. Michael Bailey can't quite see him. There's a tree in the way. Now he can. Oh, uh, you're ridiculous, sir. You're absolutely ridiculous. Fire accuracy 48. That's bullshit. Not sure if there's going to be anything down there or not. I think I'll just risk it and head to the, uh, head to the ship. Michael Bailey, leader of the breach, stay back a bit because I'm not quite sure what's going on up there. Run for that tree. He should be able to make it. Yeah. Quick maths in my head. Sometimes I'm right. Sometimes I'm horribly, horribly wrong. That's why I hate the tall grass so much, because I always forget to account for it. I'm like, yeah, you can totally make it there. Get stuck in the middle of field. Hmm. Oh, hi. Um. Boy, I hope I can kill you. Knocked him out, which is pretty cool. A little scary, but pretty cool. And unconscious ethereal is an alternative to getting a uh, mind control capable sectoid. Ah, there's a building. I thought it odd we didn't have any... Why? What a crap farm, man. This farm's like in the ghetto or something. That wall's looking, uh... Looks destroyed already. I didn't realize this mission was in Detroit. Okie Oscar Stevens, how many reactions do you have? 51. Michael Bailey's only 50. There's a lot of doors going on, and there is smoke. So the only doors that it could be are probably the ones on the side, but it could be the front door. He could just be playing with the front door. There we go. Now, Michael Bailey will probably pull off a reaction shot if the alien rounds the corner because he'll spend so many timing that's coming out and round in the corner that uh, the reaction algorithm thing will kick in and yeah, you won't make it. It's fine. I'll wait for him to get across the ship on the other side and we'll have... We'll have him open the door probably because he's a rookie. Ah, he woke up. Oops. That's a misclick. Pretty. Oh wait, these aren't ethereals, they're floaters. I'm an idiot. Really? Michael Bailey, just aim up. It's pretty much the exact same as what you've always done. There we go. I was going to say, it's really not that hard, but now that we've all spent our time in it, somebody's probably going to come out that front door there. No? Alright. Wow! Found him. Open fire. Sayonara. Yeah, I think I was saying that they were those were uh, those were ethereals, but they weren't orange enough. They're just floaters. I haven't really had many floater missions this playthrough. Oh well, that's a really really easy mission.
I'm okay with that though. And that is that large. Oh, that's a supply ship. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I get an interceptor over there from Alps? Maybe shoot him down. Even over water, I mean, I'm, I'd be okay with that. No, don't return to base. New target. Head down here. He was heading toward Africa. Ah! My god. He's coming to supply our main base. Maybe he was picking up supplies from North America and bringing it over to a base they're constructing over here? I don't really know. 